Welcome to the Pilates Show Mondays outside the Pilates studio, where we get out into the real world to explore the mind-body lifestyle. Hi there, Casey from Fusion. I wanted to show you a really easy way to make a release work tool from things that you might have with your sporting equipment. So obviously, tennis balls, very easy to get. If you don't have some laying around the house, you might have to fight kids or your dog for them. And then really good athletic tape. And this is the athletic tape that's very old school. It's um, the cloth base based athletic tape. Very, very important to have this rather than some of the other plastic ones. So we're gonna make a double tennis ball rollout tool. So what you do is you take your tennis ball and this nice tape, you get a good base, you wrap it all the way around once, just like that. Give it a little bit more than at the seam and you kind of squeeze into it. And then this is the biggest thing that you wanna do. You wanna twist it and this is the main part that's very important to keep them together. You then take the other ball on top and then you wrap again. So what you're gonna do is essentially create a figure eight wrapping technique. See how I go around? And I try to get to a part that's yellow again. And at first, it just takes a little bit of practice. And you're trying to pull the tape as tightly as you can, and then you wrap again in a figure eight pattern all the way around and you keep doing this and really be sure, I'm gonna highlight this, you want to wind the tape at a diagonal in between the two. That's what's really gonna keep it together because if you just say, put the tape on lengthwise like this, you're not really getting the really nice action of having the double tennis ball there. Um, so you really wanna make sure that you pull this tight and get that nice crease in there and the whole way through you'll notice that I'm kind of squeezing the tape onto the ball and then again we're just trying to cover and go back and forth and you're probably going to use a good amount of tape here so don't be shy with the tape it really makes a huge difference and like I said it gets easier as you go because you no longer have to hold it together it's really nicely secured and again you want to try to really kind of squeeze the tape onto the ball. And please keep going over it a few times to really get all those yellow parts of the tennis ball completely taken care of. And this will last for a very, very long time. And then of course you just tear it, seal it up. And the more you roll on it, the tighter this will actually get. And of course you wanna make sure that no sticky parts are out cause that's just annoying. But here you go, double tennis ball, voila. So you can do your release work wherever you're at with things from home. That's it for today. If you have a different take on today's subject or if there's anything you'd like to see covered in an upcoming episode, we'd love to hear from you. Comment below on Facebook, Twitter, or in the forum at fusionpilatesedu.com. See you next time and never stop learning.